let's look at this example here base class is animal which has a protected member name and a method slip a derived class dog which is inherited from animal class has a constructor and a bark method here within main we have created the object of the derived class and called the methods within the base as well as derived class let's run it and see the result the result is as expected dog sleeps and dog bark now what is this particular statement means let's try to read it a base class pointer can point to the derived class object but vice versa is not true what this particular line means in the object oriented programming say for example if i create the base class object and point that object to the derived class it is possible but vice versa is not true so what happened here is i have created the object of base class and it can point to the derived class object that is perfectly fine but the only stuff it is showing an error on this line bark because animal class doesn't contain this bark method so i can comment it for now and let's run and see the result and i will get the message dog slip whereas if you try to reverse this stuff let's create the object of derived class and point it to base class that is the reversal of it this is not possible it shows an error it shows an error here itself and if you try to run it it shows that build error cannot implicitly convert animal to dog an explicit conversion exist if you want to do it means by default you cannot do something like this so let's read it once again a base class object can point to the derived class object but vice versa is not possible this particular statement is very crucial and important when you look into the modern programming and work with the project because such features come into existence when you look at the design patterns so when you become more mature with the programming you will start understanding this concept in detail so stay tuned for more upcoming sessions thanks